Hi, I'm Claire from the Ranard Research Group and today I'm going to be showing you a few products which we use within our laboratory to try and improve our sustainability footprint. So within the Ranard Research Group it's really important to us that we can implement new technologies into some of our simple procedures that can help improve our environmental footprint. Um, an example which I'm going to show you today is this multi-position uh, dry sin block which means we no longer have to use oil, oil baths within our reactions uh, therefore meaning the much cleaner, safer, uh, reducing any risk of fire um, and possible oil contaminants within the reaction. Also what we have here is the waterless condensers which can be used under standard reflux conditions uh, without the use of uh, continuous flow of water um, which again is highly beneficial to us as scientists meaning we can reduce our risk of uh, water flooding, uh, our overall water consumption and generally improve the efficiency of our reaction and potentially reducing the amount of power in which we are using. One of the other products in which we use within our laboratory is this drying oven here. One of the main benefits of this drying oven, or downside actually, is you can't warm your hands up on the outside. This is because the drying oven is much more efficient than a typical model and you can't feel the residual heat escaping through uh, the outside of the drying oven. Great for the environment, bad for those cold hands on those winter days. One easy way in which you can implement sustainability into your lab, just like we have, is the use of the Alabo chilling unit linked up to the rotary evaporator, a commonly used laboratory piece of equipment. As you can see here, we've got our two rotary evaporators used in sync, running off the Alabo chilling fluid, rather than being conventionally attached to the cold water tap, therefore reducing our overall use of water and reducing the risk of any flood. So there I've shown you some of the few simple switches of new technology we've made into our experimental procedures to help improve our overall environmental impact. 